Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sun Tarot. I hope everybody's well. Virgo, you are up next. I'm going to go ahead and tip down because I look terrible. It's like 8.30 in the morning. I've I just did the Leo reading, but I, you know, it, it was literally just get up, throw on a sweater, brush my hair, and throw it out in cards. So I'm going to tip down so you don't see my face. All right. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, February 2022. We're going to get a flyer, then we're going to shuffle. Can I get a... F oh, hi. Queen of Pentacles. That's a lovely energy to be in. She chases no one. She gets chased. Somebody chasing you? Feel like somebody should be chasing you? That's one step down from the king, baby. You good on your own, aren't you? Judgment decided to come out. Oh. That's resurrection. Shuffle. It split at the Eight of Cups reversed and the Seven of Wands. Just so we're throwing that out there. Might be a return in the midst. Somebody coming back to claim what's theirs. Huh? Somebody gonna come back and fight for you, try to resurrect something? Let's see what the cards have to say. Well, right now you're in Hermit, so quiet introspection, very much in your energy, very much in your thoughts. Hmm. How you feel and think about whoever you're dealing with? Eh, you're willing to talk. Eight of Wands. There's going to be a conversation. I don't know about forward movement, though. That King of King of Wands is in the reverse. Queen of Cups at the bottom of the deck. I feel like you're going to practice self-love here. Okay. Let's get the energy of the person you're dealing with. Nine of Pentacles, Eight of Wands reversed. All right. Could also be dealing with an extremely independent person. Not quite up at your level, though. I don't believe there's been a lot of talking going on. Wow, my ear is ringing. Ah. Okay, okay. Spirit is talking. Spirit is talking indeed. It's my good ear too, so that was like nice and piercing. Alright, give me a flyer. Okay. Cool. Ten of Swords reversed. Mmm. Something painful hasn't ended for them. Sun's not shining. That does explain this. Okay. Logical, not overly emotional, probably very heavily guarded. Yes, they are correct, sir. 
Love it. Oh, shit. They're going to ghost. Something they can't let go of. What went down? What went down? That's what I want to know. Strength at the bottom of the deck. They're holding back. They're very much holding back. They're going to continue to hold back, too. Four of Pentacles. Dang. Just when I thought it was going to be roses. Why can't I get sunshine and roses off the cup? I don't know. <sighs> three of cups, three of swords reversed. Well, maybe y'all can come out of that place of heartbreak and come back together. We'll see. Somebody's guarded. Somebody's been through it. Somebody's still going through it. Somebody's not allowing the sun to shine in their life, friends. Four of Wands reverse, Queen of Swords reverse. Somebody's got an attitude problem. It's almost like a, everything is a disaster. Well, when you stay in that Ten of Swords reverse state long enough to where you can't allow the sun to shine in your own life because you cannot allow things, you can't let go of things, that's what happens. Do you get what I'm saying? Do you feel me? I'm not saying it's you, Virgo. I'm saying, you know, just generalizations. You're going inside. You're going down the journey. Right on? Okay, you following me? You're tracking. You're walking the path. You're doing what's got to be done. You're doing your healing. They sense that. They are extremely heavily guarded, trying to look at this from a logical perspective, trying not to get emotional, I don't think they're in touch with their emotions. They're holding back. They're going to continue to hold back. I don't think this is going to move forward because you're going to hit a locked door. I'm not even going to clarify all of these because most of them are speaking for themselves. Three of Wands Reverse. This is going to take a minute. <laughs> Potential for a resurrection is indeed there. If you are willing to wait it out. That's how I'm feeling about that right now. Because this is not looking good for the month of February at the very least. I can't say for March or anything after that. But for February, it is not looking good. Just throwing that out there. Okay. Um, talk to me about this Queen of Pentacles. We're going to jump. We're going to jump around a little bit here. That's the one that caught my eye. Oh, well. Hmm. Lovers. There's, but there was a choice. Nine of Wands. Seven of Wands. The Tower. Hmm. It's very interesting. That's my Minor Arcana Tower. Something changed in you. You're not who you were, and they know it. I apologize. Two seconds. I don't know why that just happened. I picked up the phone, and there was nobody there. Um. Then it hung up. Um, I mean, there was a visible change in you. Whatever happened, you rose up above it and you carried on and you grew. And I don't think they did. 
I think they just remained stuck in their energy. You definitely loved yourself. You're coming across as two very positive energies. The Queen of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. You have the Hermit in there. You leveled up. That's awesome. Talk to me about the star. For how the other person feels about Virgo. Ace of Swords. You healed. Okay. You've healed. You're doing your healing. You're in process. You're ready to start a new cycle. You're off to new things. They're stuck. They're stuck. There's a possibility for resurrection here, but they're stuck. They have to move, not you. I don't need to explain that any further. Give me one of that four of wands reversed. For how you feel about them. Four of wands reversed. The potential's there, but... The potential is definitely there for power couple energy. However, still sitting in the ashes of a tower. Trying to regain your balance. Either not having much to offer or not being able, willing to make the offer or communicate. Why the Queen of Swords reversed for what you think of them. Thank you. Queen of Swords reversed. Five of Cups. Bad attitude. Sad. You want to get something started. You feel the connection with them. But they're sad. Again, the potential is there, but... This knight is riding away. He's riding away. Hmm. Intended actions. One on the Eight of Wands. You're willing to talk. Six of Swords. Packing the boat, crossing the choppy waters, willing to communicate. Clear the air. But unfortunately, Six of Pentacles reversed, Page of Cups reversed might not be met with the greatest of returned energy. It's at least going to be a talking and a clearing of the air, even if a cup is not offered. Or if, or if a cup is rejected. Ace of Cups. Give me one more on that Four of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. The cup is there, but they're going to keep you locked out. 
The potential for a start is there, but you're locked out. They're still letting go, trying. They're still holding on to something that they cannot let go of. I don't know if it's involving you. Willing to talk. Could be. <laughs> this is some of you, not all of you. It could just be sex based. <laughs> Nothing more. Chariot, bottom of the deck. A potential for eventual forward movement, but you're gonna be waiting a minute. You're gonna be waiting a minute for the chariot. I'm not even gonna address this because you're waiting a minute. The chariot will move in due time. I'm not even gonna take off the bottom of the deck. I already feel like the message has come out. Give me a wisdom. Deep knowing number 43. Intuition, listening to the oracle within, empathy, hypersensitivity. Intuition is the faculty that allows you to enter into a dialogue with source, the consciousness that you are a part of but cannot see with the naked eye. It's perplexing that people are taught to ignore this natural capacity to navigate their journeys, to access their inner guidance. Know that you have an ability to read between the lines and find all the truth that was missing when the story was told, this deep knowing allows you to open the door to wisdom far greater than what is available in the limitations of human experience. You're given information that may make no sense whatsoever to logical mind or five senses, but which is 100% correct and true. The trick is to listen and then act accordingly. You are invited you are now invited into the sacred dialogue of deep knowing, so tune in and trust your vibes. They will be right. Ask, and you will receive answers from unusual sources. Virgo, friends, you're on a journey. You're walking a path. You're walking a path of source right now. Walk that path of deeper knowing. All right, friends, I got to pack it up for the day. I got to get ready to go to work earn, you know, earn my bill money and stuff. But Virgo, know that you are allowed to be blessed. I send you off with peace, love, and light. Have a wonderful rest of your February, and I will catch you when I catch you. Take care.